Hi guys, this is Rusty78609, Central Texas, USA, living in this luxurious 16-foot travel trailer that I live in. Lived in travel trailers for about 25, 30 years, long time. I'm 72 years old, and I got me a little toy here. Not a toy, it's something to cook with. Why did I get it? Because I only have a two-burner cooktop, no microwave, and no oven. So what I've done is I thought about getting a microwave because, you know, you got, I've only got so much space here, guys, as you can see, not much. And what I wanted was something that would be multi-use. In other words, I can cook with it, bake with it. You know, I mean, you can do different stuff with it. And uh, but I didn't say this. It cost me like twenty eight dollars at Walmart. And so far, it's pretty neat. I'm baking a potato for the first time right now. But let me say this before you use it. This is a Hamilton Beach toaster oven. It says four slice capacity fits a nine inch pizza, etc. And it again is 28 bucks at Walmart. And but before using it, you should, if you can, take it outside somewhere and plug it in. Heat heat it up to 450 degrees for about 10 minutes. Why? Because that gets rid of all the odor. Because uh, it even says that in the owner's manual to do that and I did it and there's a reason for it uh, something else I want to tell you the top of this thing gets really hot okay it does so be careful with that uh, uh, also once you've done the outside thing you know letting it heat up to 450 for 10 minutes you know let it cool down and then bring it in and wash off the pan and the rack you know with some soapy water and stuff and then it's ready to use basically but for me here's the box over here you can see it uh, it says Hamilton Beach toaster oven. It's got some cute little knobs and controls and stuff. The top knob is for the temperature setting. Right now I've got it set on about 400 degrees because I'm baking a potato. And I've got the middle knob. You can set it on bake or whatever. Uh, let's see what it shows there. It, sa it says bake, warm, and then you've got bagel setting, broil. And then at the bottom is the timer. And if you turn it to the left, it'll, all, it'll just stay on. And if you turn it to the right, then it becomes a timer and it'll it's pretty it's accurate because I set a timer on my Google Home device at the same time I set that on uh, 10 minutes outside and uh, yeah it's it's very accurate now as far as the heat I don't know about that yet we're gonna find out because I am trying to I'm baking a potato it's my first one and uh, but again if you have if you live in a small apartment and you know you don't have a well whatever if you need one because again you can you know toast broil bake do all kind of stuff but let me say this you got to be careful because you, the, you the only way to turn it off is you know right here you got to because i've got it on i've got the timer on but whenever you open this door if you reach inside there's not a whole lot of space in there and you're going to have a tendency to bump your hand against the sides in there if you get like a, in a few minutes i'm going to turn the potato again hey google cancel timer but anyway, so it's time for me to turn my potato again now. Google just reminded me. Even though this thing has a timer, it doesn't have a reminder. And so anyway, having said that, guys, if you're interested in something like this, it's a space saver. And, uh, you know, I'll show you. See, I just don't have a lot of space. You know, if you, have, if you live in a small apartment or you live in an RV like I do, and you want something that uh, looks functional, I think this will work. And the price is right. And if it lasts, let's just say you get three years out of it. Uh, at uh, say thirty dollars, which is a little, you know, that's I paid twenty-eight, but that'd be ten dollars a year. Uh, that's about uh, eighty cents a month that it would cost you to have this. Is it worth that to me? Yep, 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 yep. So anyway, having said that, if you're interested in it, and again, it's a Hamilton Beach. Uh, there's a model number here. I guess it says three one one four six. I'm sure you can get it at Amazon too. Same thing. Uh, but it's got an it's got some neat features, you know. In other words, if you're doing bagels and stuff like that, the uh, the there's a burner on the bottom and a burner on the top, so you can broil. But the burner on the bottom, if you put bagels in there, it will it will actually it'll kind of warm the one part of the bun and then the top toast the other side. So that pretty much, if you're into bagels, uh, this thing was pretty well designed for that purpose. So again, it's a Hamilton Beach. Got it at Walmart, but you can get it at Amazon. I'll leave a link to it in the description why because i'm an amazon affiliate and if you use the link and go to amazon and buy anything i get a small commission and uh, that's great for me and it doesn't cost you a dime doesn't cost you any extra so if you choose to use the link great if you don't don't worry about it so from central texas usa for you guys that are looking for a toaster oven uh try check out the hamilton beach you know under 30 dollars so having said that 
thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye, bye, bye. Anything you want, but use the Amazon link if you choose to. And uh, what else? Uh, drink plenty of water. Uh, take deep breaths because that lowers stress, lowers your blood pressure. Stretch, walk, you know, move, 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 move. Keep your health or otherwise you're not going to need the oven at all. So anyway, guys, enjoy your day. Adios, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year and all that stuff. Bye-bye.